What's up guys, it's Mike from All American Tag Sales back again with another house here in Shoreham, Long Island. We are doing an in-person estate sale on the 19th of May, open to the public. Everything in the house is for sale. Uh, tons of collectibles. It's an absolutely packed hoarded house with tons of collectibles, tons of items, hummels, collectibles, antiques, paintings, everything inside. Come with me, come check it out. If you like this video, like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. And we're gonna show you everything. Come on, let's go check it out. It's this high, uh, high ranch house here. Everything inside this house is for sale. Everything starting with the garage. We're gonna walk through the garage, check it out, and see what's here. Just for the light. Whole garage is packed. It's a two car garage. House is set up already. This is just the empty boxes we found inside the house. There's actually two parts of the house that just has empty boxes in it. I mean, there's everything here. You could check out. There's porcelain pieces. There's China. There's Christmas. There's Easter. Stuff for every holiday. Uh, really, just every holiday. Halloween. Outdoor decorations. Um, decorative items. Some plain glassware, some cookie jars, more Christmas items. We're gonna do a perimeter around the room to show you what's here. There's stuff in every box. So when you come, if you do come for this estate sale, you could just go into every box, you could look around, make a pile, get the best price, buy in bulk. You love everyone buying in bulk. All these boxes have stuff in them. There's nativity sets, there's Christmas ornaments, there's stocking items, uh, there's gift wrap and bow ties, there's board games. This is like a drafting table, so for like $25. Everything here, before we go inside the house, this is like a vise. There's some tool items over here, here's a grinder. Some lamps, more boxes, all this has stuff in it, like these are little exit lights, like four or five boxes of those. There's clothing in this house upstairs you'll see in a little bit, but every box has stuff in them. This is a table we didn't really set up yet. This is a Pilates Premier Machine. Alright, let's check it out. Let's see what we got here on the main tables in the two car garage. I'm going to try to do this slow. A lot of cut glass, cut crystal. Some sets. Morningware. And then all the boxes underneath are all full of stuff. Some vintage Christmas ornaments, some kitchenware, pots and pans. Alright, now who's ready to check out this in here because this is where it starts to get really interesting. Now this is just a basement. We're not even on the first level of the house. Um, so just to show you how packed it was, to give you an idea, in here, this is a bathroom. Look how much of the bathroom is packed with empty boxes. A lot of stuff from QVC, a lot of stuff from QVC. This is what the basement looks like, it's all set up. Nothing's priced out yet. We're not gonna be able to price out this entire house. It would just literally be impossible, or we would be here for weeks. Um, we have China sets, English craft, everything on the bar, behind the bar even, all shoes over there, you have cute little vintage things like this, 
Lots of stuff in this house is brand new in the package. Um, you know, never been used, brand new. These are like Radco style ornaments. But these actually might be Christopher Radco's. Nope. They're Radco style for sure. Some cookware, but again, brand new. Pots pins. Lots of decorative items on this table. And look at this wall. This wall has all boxes that we went through. I mean, this is insane. Children's books. This is definitely going to be a great sale. If you need inventory, if you're a reseller uh, doing eBay, if you do the flea markets, um, if you just like to buy for yourself, buy for your own house, buy for your own collection, this is definitely a great house for you to come check out. Um, because you're going to get great deals. It's, it's cash and carry, no credit, no debit, no PayPal, no Venmo. It's cash only. Um, come check it out on the 19th of May. We're open from uh, 9 a.m. till 2 p.m. for this house. This is like oil, vintage oil on canvas, flower prints. Another nativity set. I think we have like four or five nativity sets. Um, you have this Felix file cabinet. Going on to this table. This is all like women's pocketbooks and handbags. Um, along with some beach bags and some totes. In here you have all comforters. And sheets and blankets and pillows and everything in between. Stuff, always stuff underneath the table. Luggages. Over here as well too. This is all brand new Lennox. For all you Lennox collectors out there. This is all brand new Lennox here. Um, everything's in the box. With the original price tags of what they paid. You're going to have to do a little due diligence of opening some stuff up. Again this section right here. This is all old new stock. Everyone who loves NOS stuff. This is all old new stock items. Everything's in the package, um, Pyrex dishes, you know, Corningware, Juicer, um, you have a George Foreman grill right here. You have items and boxes everywhere, like I said. And this is just a basement, we're not even done with the whole house. Again, sorry for the mess because we are still setting up the house. But just to show you what we're doing, all these boxes are still full that we have to go through. Pretty much this whole room was filled with boxes everywhere. Um, you could see it. We put our six foot tables around. Um, I mean, Prussian Carnival, Fenton is everything on this table right here. Um, all beautiful glass, Carnival glass. Small pieces, really nice, with boxes and stuff, a lot of it signed. Candles, a whole bunch of candles on the floor, everything underneath the tables, we'll just do a scan. Underneath the table, this is more, looks like all angels and religious items and, and some Victorian pieces. Lennox. Okay, go, coming into some Christmas stuff here. There's enough stuff here to open up a full store, that's for sure. And so much of it, like I said, is all brand new. All brand new stuff. more Lennox. There's literally Lennox everywhere in this house. Alright, we're gonna follow and go upstairs. This is, again, this is the first floor. Uh, this is technically the basement, but the main level, um, that matches up with the driveway. This is the laundry room over there. There's some, uh, drawers and stuff. Um, so, up here is not quite as done yet. So coming into the back room here, we have these beautiful stained glass windows with this cathedral ceiling. 
Um, this is like the back lounge room, the living room, you would say, den area. Country style furniture, thick wood, heavy duty, um, with that old school country farmhouse, you know, needlepoint uh, cushions. You have these two recliners, leather recliners with the handles on the side. You have barrel and gun uh, lamp there with side tables. Then you have these two matching side tables here. This is a nautical theme dehumidifier, uh, not dehumidifier, um, I forget the name of this, but uh, this is the nautical theme one here. You have some oil on canvas. You'll see a lot of oil on canvas here. This is the vintage pieces we have. So we try to measure everything out for everyone. You'll see the measurements of the piece of what it is. Same thing goes with these matching three um, pieces. This is really beautiful, um, you know, solid wood carved matching end tables with a matching coffee table. This is a pretty cool lamp. This is like the carpenter's lamp. If you see it, you can see a plane on there, a couple chisels. That's a really cool for a man cave. Nice full sofa. Another oil on canvas here. This is a Black Forest Cuckoo Clock. Alright, coming into the kitchen. Again, this up here is not really set up at all. We're just going to span the room. These cabinets are filled. Um, there's stuff everywhere. Open up. Sorry. Definitely are filled. Carnival glass. I'm gonna hold this light open because it doesn't technically work right now. But if you could see over there, you have all that a gold trim glassware, cut glass crystal, all in that china cabinet over there. The dining room table with six chairs. There's two leafs. There's some religious items right here on this uh, console table that matches the one in the living room with the two end tables and coffee table. This is a F. Ferrelli um, painting, 31 by 27. Here is another painting there. All right, we're gonna scan into what we're gonna make into our cash register room, our main room. It is a step down. So just watch your step. You know, walking into this formal living room, you're going to see a lot of cool stuff in here. Because this is where the cash register system is going to be. Um, we do have uh, three dish, uh, jewelry cases of costume jewelry that is not here yet. The homeowner has to bring it all back. Um, but we have to come back and set that all up. And you can check out those photos on our Instagram or on... Uh, EstateSales.net for all American tag sales. And you have this really nice Asian inlay uh, buffet, buffet style table. Tons and tons of teacups. Same thing right here. Tons of teacups everywhere. This is a vintage, you know, forest scene with a windmill and a river, signed by Donald. Um, you have, so these are matching here, the two uh, end tables, one, two with glass top and a matching coffee table glass top. Has some etched glass on it, some Lennox pieces. Lots of Hummels in this house, folks. If you're a Hummel collector, this is probably a house you definitely want to be at. Because these are all Hummels here. As well as here. Now let me show you the rest of the Hummels. We have some downstairs. But look at all these Hummels here. Everything. Every shelf is Hummels. It's wild. And then more on the floor. That we're still going through. This is a really cool mid-century glass set. You know, has really nice color to it. You can see. With the gold and the green. 
Really nice set there. You have some Jadeite pieces. There's vintage Pyrex here. You, uh, uh, we, we skipped this. This is heavy brass. Uh, provincial, Italian provincial with the cherubs on the bottom. The small little details. You know, matching. Um, let's, do, let's see the dining table. This is cool. Like glazed pottery signed. Sign there. Two pieces of that. I'm sure there's more around the house. This looks like it's Roseville. Yep, Roseville. Right there. Getting a scan of everything that's in here. It's wild how much glass there is. And every, like I said, every drawer is full of stuff. So, it's definitely going to be a pretty large estate sale. Um, we're going to try and let as many people in the door as possible. Again, like I said, there was no costume jewelry here yet, but we know that we're getting costume jewelry from the homeowners. They don't live currently at this home. All linens and table linens. And then there's a large collection of Thomas Kincaid that we're going to show you. Lots and lots of Thomas Kincaid. All have the certificate of authenticities. This is one right here. A uh, pool of scenery. Thomas Kincaid 32 by 29. You have this one here. Uh, teacup Cottage. By Thomas Kincaid. All signed. With the stamp. Right there you can see. 32 by 26 and a half. We're going to make a left into the bedroom here. This closet has quite a bit of stuff in it. Let's we'll view the bedroom. Let's see if I can get a light on in this closet here. Yep. Some vintage clothing, some men's clothing, um, some suit jackets and suits. You know, try to sell these, 10 bucks, 5, 10 bucks, you know, ties. We sell all our ties for $2 each. You know, a lot of them, like I said, have tags on them. Um, so all our ties are $2 each or 3 for 5. Always leave room for people to make money. You know, and get a great deal, of course. So, now going into the... One of the, pro this is probably the secondary suite, um, on suite in this house. Really nice solid wood furniture and wood matching mirror. Real nice Asian style uh, cherry wood dresser. Some hurricane lamps, another Thomas Kincaid. Uh, this is called a Mountain Chapel, 26 by 31. There is three or four jewelry chests like this all for jewelry chests really nice pieces this is another thomas kincaid right here solid wood country style furniture this is a stand-up mirror another kincaid there dresser and uh, this is actually a massive jewelry cabinet here all right so let's show you uh, this is like the sewing room you know office could be a bedroom actually is a bedroom too because there's a closet but you have these two jewelry cases empty of course but they are for sale you have these barrister bookcases this is the new style barrister not the antique they do come down and they do work um, all books, side lamp, lots of sewing stuff. Uh, this is a brother's sewing machine, paint, arts and crafts. Um, this is our one of our religious tables we're gonna make that we have all the religious stuff on. A painting by Frank, vintage from the seventies. A screen board. Some computers, a desk, pretty wild house. 
for sure because we're still not even done. Uh, going into the primary suite. Matching end tables with matching Italian provincial lamps. Real gaudy from the 70s, you know. A solid wood dresser with mirror, chairs, another jewelry um, cabinet. Uh, Thomas Kincaid piece right there called the Peaceful Time. This is the Tall Boy. And that's another Kincaid there on the wall. They definitely like their Kincaid, that's for sure. Um, one more here. And you have all these boxes here. The whole collection of Marie Osmond fine collections. It's so much, we have to go through it all. Well, uh, there is an outdoor shed, we're not much in it, um, but we, we, we're not really going to check that out. But guys, again, so just want to go over some details so everybody knows what's a little bit going on. This is an estate sale that's open to the general public. Anyone could possibly come. Um, we are going to be open from 9 a.m. till 2 p.m. on Friday the 19th of May. Open to the general public. It's going to be first come, first serve. Whoever wants to come first and start a list, they can. Um, and we're going to take it from there. We're going to get in as many people as we can through the door. Um, come get a great deal because after this estate sale is over, we're going to be photographing for an online auction. And then we're post everything up onto Auction Ninja. You can follow out other sales. Follow us on Instagram um, because that's where we literally post every single day. You could see the behind the scenes, the setting up, the going through the houses, and, and yeah, and really seeing what we do, and how you could get a great deal on, on such awesome stuff. Alright guys, like and subscribe this video, I would really appreciate it, and hope to see you guys all soon. Take care.